So everybody's been looking at their Spotify Wrapped recently. And I don't know why, but I decided to wait until now, when I'm completely free for like a couple days, to react to my Spotify Wrapped. And I'm wondering if anything has changed since last year, and I'll put the results up now from last year. The screenshots, as you can see. Bit of a uh, wide range there, but I'm hoping that this year a few things change, because I feel like this year was the most uh, I've delved into all genres of music, like, in my life. <laughs> like, I'm all in it right now. So, let's look at my Spotify wrapped, and you guys tell me in the comments if it's valid or trash. So here we are on Spotify, and here it is, your 2023 wrapped. Let's do it. So 2023 wrapped. So hello, Chai Katata. Hello. It's wrap time. Ready? Let's do this. All right, let's see. 2023 was a feast for your ears. You listened to 33 genres, huh? How, how did your taste stack up? Let's find out. Ah, clever, you know, just like the sandwiches. Let's see. Okay, so. Top five genres, your top genres, delicious, thank you. So rock, hip hop, pop, soul, and new metal. New metal, it's probably just Limp Bizkit. That's probably the only th thing I listened that is new metal. This year your listening took you places, and one place listened just like you. San Luis Upsico, USA? No, wait, 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 wait. Like, I I've never heard of that place before. Okay, people there are far more familiar to be fans of The Beatles, Mac Miller, and Kanye West. Okay. Alright. You played 1,108 songs 2023, and there was one that really connected. What's my most played song? Death by C418. Well, it's one of the absolute bangers of the Minecraft soundtrack, I will be honest with you. It's one of the absolute best deep cuts of the Minecraft soundtrack. Which is, by the way, that soundtrack is phenomenal. Please listen to it from beginning to end. It will change your life, okay? You played it 135 times this year, starting on January 3rd, and it still sounds perfect. It does. It does still sound perfect. But you had room in your heart for more than one favorite. You romantic you. Like, the things they, they, they say, it's like weird. Okay, top five, let's go. Uh, so we just saw Death, Just Like This from Lim Biscuit. okay. The G-Funk intro from Snoop Dogg, okay. A Violent Tale, Coldplay, and Hollywood swinging Cool in the Gang, okay. Not not too bad of a, a bit of an arrangement there. You have a little bit of everything there. Time is a con construct, but we kept track anyway. You listened for 20,430 minutes. That's 14 days nonstop, wow. You peaked on August 1st at 185 minutes. And you were in the top 18 of listeners worldwide. That's awesome. Okay, yeah. Any guesses? So, the one came out on top. Okay, the Beatles. So, I'm going to imagine I'm probably in like the top 1% of like Beatles listeners. Because I listen to a lot of Beatles from time to time. So, I'm probably in like the top 1%. But let's see. So, yeah, Beatles expected. Yeah. Say hello to your top artist. The Beatles! You're, you're a top 0.5% fan and you spent 2,435 minutes together. Wow. I'm probably like, like that is absolutely phenomenal. Like nobody, I can't think of any other person that listens to more Beatles than me. That's awesome. Okay, and that and that's my most listened to Beatles songs. That's Dear Prudence. You had something special with your top artists. Here's how you spent your time with them across the year. So the Beatles, number one, peak listening month, May. Number two, Kanye, peak listening month is January. Okay. I wonder what I listened to then. And then Kendrick, another peak month in January. And C418, another one in January! Wow, January was a big year for, you know, big month and January again for Eminem. Wow. Last year he was number two, but this year he's number five. Okay, pretty solid top five there. I like it. I like it. That was fun. It sure was. Same time next year? Definitely. All right, and here's the, the, the full thing. So you guys can see the, the, the summary right there. Yeah, overall, I thought it was pretty solid. I think it showed 
how good uh, I am of uh, my music taste. If you want to put in the comments below what do you think of my music taste, please let me know. But other than that, same time next year.